influenza every year causes anywhere between 20 to 40,000 deaths here just in the U.S. Um, and the predominance of those deaths in hospitalizations as well um, are among the very young uh, infants and the very old. Influenza is caused by a specific virus uh, called the influenza virus that typically circulates in the wintertime. And a lot of other viruses circulate in the wintertime as well that can cause respiratory infections. Some of them like to uh, stay in the upper respiratory tract and closer to the nose, and that's why the common cold kind of typically causes, you know, stuffy nose, runny nose, sinus congestion. Um, some of the other viruses can uh, cause deeper infections like a pneumonia. Um, and influenza can cause more generalized infections like high fevers and muscle aches all over. So we encourage now uh, for everyone in the population to get vaccinated, even recognizing that there are certain segments of the population that are not at high risk, but it is um, serious, again, in the high risk segments of our population, the debilitated, the immune compromised, the very young, the very old. And so again, we encourage the entire population to be vaccinated to protect those segments of the population that are at high risk for the more severe disease from influenza. What we do at the Center for Vaccine Development is certainly vaccine development. So what we would like to do is make these vaccines a little bit more potent so that they result in better vaccine responses. Moreover, very soon we're going to see uh, a newer influenza vaccine that has four strains instead of just three strains incorporated called a quadrivalent vaccine and that'll be coming up very soon on the horizon.